It's an honor to uh, be here this morning with you all. Uh, I'll make my remarks uh, very brief, but we're delighted uh, to uh, have the opportunity to uh, participate in men's soccer, a sport that's very important to not just the university, but I think to the state with, with the growth of the sport overall, uh, to be able to participate in the uh, MAC uh, as we move forward with our men's soccer program. Uh, Coach LeBlanc uh, can go into a little bit more detail, but I do want to thank Terry Howes, uh, our uh, sport administrator for men's soccer, for the work she's put in over the last six, seven, eight months and, uh, and with, with, with this issue. Uh, it's obviously, I think as everybody knows, uh, uh, one of two sports that we will have uh, which are not sponsored by uh, the, the Big 12 men's soccer and of course Rifle. Rifle doesn't have any issues because it competes, as I think everybody knows, in the Great American Rifle Conference and that will continue to be the case. Uh, you know, it, men's soccer has done uh, extraordinarily well here in Morgantown at the university over the last uh, number of years, really since Coach LeBlanc has been here. Uh, he's uh, in his soon to be seventh season, uh, a great track record for NCAA tournament appearances, including uh, two back-to-back -back appearances the last couple of years, five All-American players, has a winning percentage just a notch under 600. We're going to change that and bump it up to 600. Uh, and what I really appreciate is the fact that uh, our attendance at men's soccer matches as well as at the women's games, but our attendance has really grown uh, incredibly well, and uh, uh, that's attributed in part, I think, to certainly the competitiveness of the of the team and, and how well the team has played, but also, uh, I think, because of the growth of the sport. Soccer clearly is is one of the sports that uh, is on a very nice uh, trajectory in this country in terms of uh, popularity at the professional level, at the collegiate level, and down into the youth level. And uh, Marlon and his coaches really have done a marvelous job at the youth level as well. So uh, we think this is a, a very good move for us. Uh, there was a lot of uncertainty with uh, other potential conference affiliations in terms of travel and some other things. So we, uh, we f feel this is a very uh, strong move for our program. I think, as many of you know, there are a couple of uh, very good teams uh, playing uh, men's soccer in the MAC, including Akron, a, uh, a you know a perennial top five uh, program. And in fact, we watched uh, their coach last night in the uh, men's U23 game against El Salvador. They unfortunately lost in a on a very late goal. But uh, Akron's a very strong program. Look forward to having them uh, come to Morgantown and going up there as well. Northern Illinois over the years has had a very strong program. Uh, this will be will be number eight. I think in terms of the uh, count in, in the MAC, uh, but a good, a, a very good situation for us. Uh, uh, travel that uh, is not uh, cross country as it could have been with some other affiliations, and I think at the end of the day, this is a very uh, good move for our men's soccer program. And uh, with that, I will turn it over to head coach Marlon LeBlanc. Thanks, Oliver. First, I want to thank um, Dr. Steinbrecher, the commissioner of uh, the MAC, uh, Jeff Bacon at the MAC, Terry Howes, our Associate AD, uh, President Clements, and uh, Oliver Luck, certainly for uh, giving me, as I mentioned in the statement, the green light to pursue the best avenue for our program moving forward. Um, you know, the, the Big East was a wonderful league for us over the uh, six years I've we spent in the Big East. We were arguably one of the top two or three teams in that league over that time period. Um, so we enjoyed very, six successful years in the Big East with, with my affiliation here with WVU and uh, a few more before that. But that being said, um, we're looking forward to the next chapter for the program. Uh, when I was given the green light, my, my initial uh, question for Oliver was, are we going to continue to push men's soccer in a direction that will continue our uh, ascension up the top of the national polls and, and, and hopefully towards a national championship? And the answer was unequivocally yes, um, and do what you need to do in order to keep us in that realm. And at the end of the day, um, we decided that the MAC was going to be the best fit for us uh, for a number of reasons. And obviously, there are a few other affiliate memberships out there. Conference USA came up. Uh, independent status came up for us. Uh, but at the end of the day, we believe that the MAC was going to give us the opportunity, the best opportunity, to continue our, our push towards winning a national championship here at WVU.